1912, in Croatian town Abazia, King's Gambit accepted theme tournament was held, organized by Georg Marko. In that tournament, 12 players crossed swords who met each other twice. Hello chess lovers, Soren here and in this video I want to share with you a game played at that same tournament mentioned above between Austro-Hungarian chess player Richard Reiti and Russian-Uzbekistani chess player Sergei Freiman. As this was a King's Gambit accepted tournament, the game started from this position and in here Reiti played knight f3, Freiman responded with g5, bishop c4, g4 and white castled kingside. Muzio Gambit is on the board, but instead of going for immediate g takes f3 move, black made this strange looking d5 move. In many cases in king's gambit black is playing this move in order to open up the light squared bishop's diagonal and complete the queenside development as soon as possible. Also the bishop can be useful when organizing the defense, but in this case playing d5 doesn't give black much. He takes d5 by Reti and only in here black accepted the peace sacrifice. Queen takes f3, bishop d6, black sticks to this pawn, d4, knight e7 and bishop takes f4. Finally white is winning this pawn and now can put further pressure on black's kingside. Here black castled kingside, knight d2, knight g6, queen e3, king g7, rook e1, knight d7, knight e4, and f5. With active moves black is trying to repel white's attack, although black's kingside looks somewhat vulnerable. Knight g3, knight b6. Uh, of course f4 can't be played because of this knight h5 check, that's why after knight g3 we see knight b6 answer, but anyways knight h5 check followed. King h8, threatening mate in one, and rook g8. Black is covering the g7 square, but this is a losing move, instead it was very important to cover the 7 franc by playing rook f7. If bishop b3, then queen f8. But instead we see rook g8, and as we have reached the critical position, please pause the video and try to find white's next moves. Ready? Now look, at this point rook e8 may seem tempting, but uh, you can't do much by playing queen f7, black is managing to repel white's attack. That's why after rook g8 we see a powerful d6 move. White is not only opening up the light squared bishop's diagonal, but in some cases is even ready to play rook e7. For example, right now if you accept the bishop's sacrifice, then you can step into rook e7 move. And now if knight takes e7, then queen f6 check followed by Queen takes g7, checkmate. Uh, that's why to d6 black answered with queen f8 and it was in here that white landed another heavy punch and he played uh, a move which quite possibly you already noticed, rook e8. Yes, rook e8 already works. Accepting the queen sacrifice uh, can be catastrophic, you can get checkmated on the spot and actually at this point Freiman resigned, although he could still make a few more moves. Uh, now let's take a look what if queen takes e8 then this time white can play knight f6 and if queen d7 then simply knight takes d7. But the thing is that in this case against the queen black is getting two pieces and a rook. White has a totally winning position but anyways from a human perspective white should still prove it. Let's take a look at one of the possible lines. d takes c7 Rook takes c7 is not good because of this rook e1 and if a move like bishop d7 then white can either choose between knight takes h7 or h4. h4 is a stronger continuation and then h5. If knight e7 then knight takes d7 and then queen e6 and then I don't know d5. Uh, of course white's position is totally winning, black can't put no resistance but yes once again uh, Freiman could still make some more moves, well, but he had different ideas and after this staggering rook e8 move he capitulated. Well that was a very nice combination by Reti, first d6 and then rook e8, which I hope that you enjoyed greatly. In my previous video the critical position was included as a daily puzzle and 
uh, finally now you got the solution to it in the end a chess puzzle for you where the task is to find the mating line for white it's white to move and i will wait for your answer in the comment section uh, feel free to check out the playlist of king's gambit games as well i will see you in my next video take care